Okay, here's the front of 310 Ben Johnson. Here's your neighbors. It's a nice street. All these right here are pretty contemporary houses. Okay, we'll go inside. Looks like the uh, lamps need a little love. Easy fix though. Okay, here's our entryway. Stairs going up. Nice laminate flooring. Here would be, I guess, your coat closet. When you first come in. Here's your living room. It does have a fireplace. Set up for gas logs, but the gas logs aren't in it right now. Put your TV up there. Nice big deep lot. Here's your kitchen. Does have the non slam drawers. Here's your pantry. Here's where your fridge goes. And it does look like the um, fence is the neighbors like we were talking about. So there's the neighbor's fence. It is a good deep lot. It goes up the hill so it's just a real long deep narrow lot looks like it needs a little pressure washing back here but that's an easy fix Does have a little half bath down here. And then here's your garage area. Here's your hot water heater. And it looks like it does have a water shut off in here for the house in case you ever have to shut it off and you don't want to have to do it at the street, you can do it inside. Now we'll go upstairs. And here's your upstairs area. Here's your office. Hey guys, sorry to disturb you. And then here is your upstairs bathroom. Nice granite countertop. Real ceramic tile on the floors. There's your Linen closet.
Here is bedroom number two. Decent size closet. Here is your laundry area. Once again, real ceramic tile. And then here's your master bedroom. Here's one of your closets. It's two closets. So I guess you could put your bed against this wall. Nightstands on each side. Maybe a um, chest of drawers there. And then you've got a second closet over here for more storage. This one's actually a little bit bigger than the first one. This one's more of a walk-in. And then here's your master bath. Once again, real ceramic tile. Okay, here's our drive out. There's the house. So you can kind of see the uh, neighborhood and everything. There's a little ball field right here on the right. And then here's Highway 357. So it uh, takes you right into Lyman, or you could probably take a right here at this four-way stop, and um, you can be in Greer in about 15 minutes. There's a fire department here on this corner. A little gas station right here. This little place over here sells plants and ice cream. Um, there's a little hardware store up here on the left. Holly Springs Hardware. They also sell plants and mulch and all kind of stuff like that. And like I said, if you stay on this road, you'll be in, um, Lyman in about five or ten minutes. So, uh, you know, not too far out from everything. So, uh, let me know what you think. Thank you.